Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be doing a couple of reactions and uh, yeah, so I just know I have a lot of stuff to catch up on and I'm going to start with Taeyeon even though I, uh, Taeyeon? I hope I'm saying that correctly. I'm going to start with her <laughs> even though I know she just came out yesterday and there's like things that I have to watch before her but I am such a hardcore stan of hers. I'm not going to say her name anymore because I don't know if I'm saying it correctly, but um, it's really weird because I didn't get into K-pop when Girls' Generation was active, which is really unfortunate, but um, yeah, I just like, it wasn't really on my radar and uh, I got into it when Red Velvet debuted and um, I learned about girls generation because they were from the group before that and i just was like really curious about music in general and a whole bunch of things when i was younger and i actually ran a music blog with my friend it was called like peach vinyl so i used to just um like read up about a lot of different genres and k-pop was something that i was interested in so yeah um so eventually I got into Girls' Generation, I have a bunch of their songs saved on my K-pop EP, I mean, playlist, <laughs> but um, I really do like Taeyeon as a, so a soloist, and uh, I love uh, Hyland as well. I love Dessert. I don't get why some people don't like Dessert. It's so weird because people will literally be like... <coughs> I don't know, I just feel like if you're gonna like, uh, no shade, but like if you're gonna like an Itzy or like an Espa song, and I don't think that these are bad groups, but if you're gonna like those, how are you gonna be like, Dessert is not a good song? <laughs> Cause those fandoms are like so notorious for being like, oh no, like this song is good, you just don't get it. So yeah, um, I really love Dessert and I love uh, Taeyeon, and my favorite song from her is, um, like, Love You Like Crazy. It was on the EP, gosh, what was this song that was on that project? Spark, I think? Yeah, um, <clears throat> so the reason I really love her and was able to really get, uh, get into her without have, uh, been listening to k-pop in my personal opinion during the time that her group was active at least which i hope they come back to some extent i guess like ogg i don't know if they're all there from that group either but um that one song they have is a bop or how many of her songs they have but that title track so back to my favorite uh why i got into Taeyeon because one she's really great vocals she's like one of the best vocalists uh two she has really great songs and uh, b-sides as well. She has such good b-sides and she kind of like has a different, not, not like it's complete, she kind of she has her own sound and image and it's really interesting because she's kind of like contemporary but yet she's still really interesting to watch and I know that it's like the two don't have to be synonymous but sometimes when people are singing a lot of like ballad kind of songs and slow tempo songs you know you can just kind of start to get bored and um she just always keeps my interest because she's always doing something a little bit different it may have a little beat that will bring you in or some really cool, cool choreo or visuals her music videos are so amazing i i just love watching her music videos so <clears throat> yeah that's basically how i feel about her i obviously i saw the girls on top stage what i thought about that was it was great i feel like they were kind of robbed overall um because they released like a stage performance video and it's like supposed to be a fill-in for a music video i guess and i just think that's all so bizarre in my opinion they should have just gave given them a full comeback and had them like perform on music shows even if it was just two or three performances i don't get why sm does this things specifically to their girl groups it doesn't make sense to me but um 
yeah, I think that would have been really cool to see them perform on a couple of music shows and then pop go into Taeyeon's um, <clears throat> comeback. I know she would have been really busy, but she was probably busy maybe anyways doing it. Or maybe they just like met up a couple of times, like three times, and you know, they just got this thing taken care of, you know? So, I don't know, but it would have been really cool if their schedules permitted them to do like tape two or three live stages or like a studio tomb or whatever you know um yeah kind of sad not gonna lie uh, i feel like it could have just it was supposed to be a moment i mean you had all these girls from with these groups that are really iconic even espa has managed to do so much in their like year and how many of the months they've been here and it just feels like sm never really like treats them the way that they should be treated when it comes to promotions and stuff and even though with their newer group aespa you see some problems arise which is really unfortunate overall they're they seem to be managed pretty well um yeah i don't really have much to say i haven't really been following aespa as much lately as far as like what they do behind the scenes i used to a little bit but now i'm not really so certain on what the girls are up to i don't know if they're supposed to be filming a comeback but honestly they probably are because sm just loves giving them things for the moment we'll see um i'd love to see a subunit but i guess it's too early for that anyways i've been talking for too long and I need to react to a lot of things, so let's get into this. I have my glasses on today because I'm like, no, I need to see. She's so pretty. Wow, I didn't know sh this was gonna happen. <coughs> wow, she's so pretty. I love the um, acoustics on her. Like, does she age? Does, can anybody answer this? <laughs> can anybody confirm that Taeyeon ages? everything that's going on right now. visuals are just crazy in this video. I, I don't even know what else to say. The song is great too, okay? The song is great, the music video is great. Everything I think is great, but her visuals are just taking me out right now.
happened. Let me see if that's an EP. Sorry, is it not like Hold on, what is my Spotify doing? Is this song out yet? Okay. Whew. Oh my goodness, my Spotify was doing something so bizarre. I don't know why it did that. I don't know if that's just like how the song is set up for some reason, but I swear to you, I could not find it. I need to make like two K-pop playlists. I need to make like my ultimate one when I want to listen to everything. I need to make like my current one of the current songs that I'm just going to have on repeat. Because I feel like there's going to be like a new cycle of songs coming out now, but my last songs on repeat was like... Queendom, XO, XO from So Mean, um, Stereotype, uh, Money by Lisa, um, yeah, that's all I can think of. I'm pretty sure there's more, but, uh, yeah, so that was just a single, so that means she's gonna come back again at some point, um, which I think is super cool, I mean, yeah the visuals with this not just like her visuals but i mean the overall image imagery she uses in this song and it seems like her team and or her has planned out they're very strong so it'd be really cool to see them in live stages and this single can just kind of it's a good promotional single whatever you're gonna call it it'll probably end up on the album but yeah, I mean, I really like it. It's catchy. It kind of has this, like, 2000s, early 2000s rock, pop rock feel to it, which is it's just, like, I'm trying to figure out, is this the new sound for K-pop? Is this kind of pop rock thing going on here? Um, not mad at it, but at least it's phasing out of maybe, like, empty choruses with beat drops, you know? Even I've debuting. It was electronic of course but it was a little bit different so um i'm excited i think it's cool because i think we're kind of going back into like making traditional songs again and just making good songs and good music so yeah i'm really excited about that and i'll see you guys in my next video let me know what you think of i can't control myself <coughs> and um what are your predictions for her, pr her next project? What do you think is, what is the New Year's going to be for Taeyeon? Like, I really just, she's one of those artists where I'm just like, I don't even predict anything. I'm just like, whatever. You're going to do something that I can't predict. I'm going to love it. So what do you guys think? You guys might know a little bit more than me. And then also song recommendations, because although I do know like a lot of her newer stuff and some of her older stuff i still like don't know her like uh first couple of things that she did like project or whatever so if you guys have song recommendations that would be amazing because i do love to and i want to get more into her and um if you guys even have like ogg or girls generation song recommendations <coughs> b-sides and um or like just tracks that people don't really like as much then yeah that would be awesome and i will see you guys next time Bye.